There we go. There, now it's working. Hey, my plumbing bros. Hey, I think we're all right sided up here. <laughs> all right. Hey, what are you guys doing on your Saturday? What's going on with your Saturday morning? No, what, what have we done this Saturday morning? In fact, hey, we got the million dollar plumber and a lovely Laura here. We got the, uh, it's like the army. We do, we do more than what most people do before 9 a.m. in the morning every day. We're, we're, we're the army here. <laughs> all right. I think so. Yeah, we've already got, we've been working on the business, mm -hmm. building that legacy, mm -hmm. great workout in. What are you guys doing? You, you, have you had, are you just in that attitude of surviving, working for the weekend? Working for the weekend. Lover Boy, what was that song? Yeah. Buddy is working. Are you one of those? Have you bought into that crap? I know we're plumbers. Hey, I'm talking to you plumbers. All right, okay, have you bought into that crap? You know, have you been hypnotized? What is it? Hypnotized, euthanized, bottomized, <laughs> and believing that you're working for the weekend. Thank God it's Friday. Are you one of those guys or gals and bought into that crap? Or are you working on your empire? What are you doing today? You're gonna go watch the kids kick the little ball around in the field or something? Or you're gonna go do that kind of thing, which is okay to do that, but your whole life doesn't revolve around that. You can't take care of those kids just sitting there in the seat getting fatter. You know, all right. Yeah, you know, much to say. Nice. No, I mean, you're I'm, right, right, I'm on a roll here. Hey, these going. guys, everybody, they just, you know, the guys just keep getting fatter and fatter. You know, because we mm -hmm. bought into this crap. You know, and you work, you're working for the working for the weekend. You know, I just, I want more for you. You know, I, as a younger man, I, I've, I've seen it all, and you know, 55. You know, and where we're at, and you know, I hear the guys whining, bitching, and moaning, and crying. Sure, they're all, I know you don't like it, they're all tatted up and they're throwing F-bombs out there, watching their porn, throwing their porn out on the sites, you know, and they're thinking you're, you're thinking you're all that and all that and you're just getting poorer and poorer. You're just more of a slave, more of a slave and you're being used. Now, I hate seeing you guys being used. I'm talking to you, plumbing bro. You're being used and inside of you, you were created to do great things and there's a dream in you and it might just be a little spark right now because you've been beat down, okay? You've been beat down and, and told you're supposed to get in line and, and that you can't do it. That's a lie, that's a lie. You can do it. And the reason I know that you can do it is because that's where I come from, you know? Mm -hmm. Sure, I'm the, the million dollar plumber now. You know, sure, I'm good looking, you know? <laughs> you are good looking. Yeah, sure, I got it. <laughs> you know, I'm 55 years old, throwing weight around. You know, if you want to step out in the parking lot, I'll step out in the parking lot with you. I can take you. I got the eye of the tiger still, all right? It's better than when I was 21. And so can you, all right? But I come from the projects. Grew up in a broken home, you know? Mommy and daddy wasn't there, you know? Doesn't matter, you know? Uneducated. Okay, grew up in the apartments. A lot of you guys have that same kind of story. You know, I was a bad boy, kind of went the bad boy route. You know, sure, I smile. You know, I got a good smile, right? <laughs> like my smile? I do. Yeah, you like it, baby? <laughs> I do. All right. I'm a fan. Hey, but don't take my smiles for weakness, man. You know? And uh, you guys got it, too. And so I, I watched you guys, and I had to listen to you guys. And, you know, you bought into this crap of, you know, thank God it's Friday. And then long about Sunday, you know, you're, oh man, tomorrow's Monday. Oh, I got to go to work. You know, you look at it as work instead of building a legacy. All right. So I, I want that for you guys. You can do it. So, you know, work on that this weekend. You know, it's, a fa it's Father's Day. What are you doing for Father's Day? Mm -hmm. You know? Maybe like, dream with your wife. What yeah. You want your legacy for your family to be. Really sit down and take some time and plan and and dream a little bit. And yeah, don't um, come up with this crap that I'm the wrong color, you know, or I come from the wrong background, or the man isn't for me. All that, that pansy whining, and bitching, and moaning crap. It's all crap. They want you to buy into that. They want you to buy into that. And so that's where they keep you down. That's how you do become a slave. You've enslaved yourself. And I hope I'm pissing you off because you've enslaved yourself. You're a slave, bro, if you bought into that crap. You're a slave. You put the chains on you, and you've enslaved your wife, and you've enslaved your children. You've enslaved your grandchildren. Get out of it. It's, it's simple to get out of it. You just decide. 
decide and then do the different work do the different work take yourself seriously all right get um, learn the things that you need to learn it's and never been easier it's There's never so been easier to learn different ways to bring in different revenue streams well, I don't I don't I don't understand Facebook uh, you old guys what you bunch of pansies come on well what was in your Wheaties this morning I don't know they just had a good workout and just thinking about it you know hey I come from the trenches guys <laughs> I'm not some kind of accountant that's bought bought a plumbing company and grown plumbing company and trying to sell you plumbing company bullcrap, okay? I'm the guy that started started digging in the ditches. I've had to put up with all the crap that you you had to put up with. You know, you had to make your way. You had to learn this stuff, you know. And so I, I get it. I've been there, done that. That's why I can talk about that. And I've survived it. And I've done more than survived. I've thrived it. You know, got hit in the face so many freaking times I can't even feel the face. I'm still good looking. <laughs> You know, I still got these teeth. I still can smile. You know, that's because I get back up. I get back up. Get back up. They ain't gonna keep me down. They're not gonna tell me what I can, cannot do. All right? Okay. And they, they don't have to tell you what you can and cannot do. But you gotta decide. You gotta put down the freaking joystick. Stop with the gaming. All right. If you, if you're a guy, unless you're playing with your kid every once in a while, every once in a while, if you're playing games, that's that's pansy stuff. You're a little boy. Stop behaving like a little boy. Man up, okay? Man up and do what you gotta do to create the legacy for you and your family, all right? There's a battle out there. It's a war out there, all right? And you're either, you're either gonna be the, the king of your own domain or you're gonna be a slave, period. And right now, most of you, or what I watch and see and hear, you're acting like slaves. Get out there and man up. And I'm not talking about throwing out more F-bombs, getting another tat, or, you know, talking all trash. You guys want to come back and, you know, the haters that I get, I, you know, the hell with you. I'm not talking about haters. I'm talking about the, the men. Man up and get it done, you know. So spend some time this weekend dreaming about it. Hey, also it's important to be around others. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to invite you to something here. And this you know, for you guys that are just looking to you know, that want to be slaves, this isn't for you. This isn't for you. So you guys can just tune out, shut out, go go back to watching your porn, playing your games, you know, thinking about the next tat you want to get, okay? You know, and throw me an F-bomb, all right? So there, there you go. But for you guys that want to be winners, they're looking to win. I'm talking about winning, creating um, the environment and the life that you want for you and your family that you dreamed about, that there's still a little flame in there. And the, little man, the man in you, the man in you that wants to rise up and stand up and get it done. I'm talking to you. you got to be around other men. you got to be around other winners. Even you gals, okay? You gals in the plumbing business. you got to be, you got to be, um, winning is not, um, um, you know, winners aren't a matter of what sex you are or what, uh, you know, what race you are or what country you live in. Winning is winning, all right? Winning is winning. So I'm talking to you folks, okay? You, my plumbing bros and sisters, all right? You got to be around others. So come be part of my inner circle, all right? Just to be around. There's information there to help you grow your business. Um, but more importantly, it's to be around others who are thinking about winning, all right? There's something that rubs off on you. So, you know, get, get away from the crap of the, you know, if you're, if you're not yet started your own plumbing business or, you know, you know hanging around the, the, your friends, the, you know, yeah, I, I get the, the old friend thing. But uh, they're dragging you down, all right? Your friends don't want you to succeed, all right? They, some want to kind of want to protect you, but really they don't want you to succeed. So, so down this road right here. Okay. Um, so you need to be around other winners. Go to www.themilliondollarplumber. The million, the dollar, million plumber. dollar plumber. That's me, all right? Forward slash go dash pro, all right? Be part of it, all right? There is a little fee to help cover the cost. I'll just tell you that right up front. It's less than a dollar a day. If you can't afford that, you need to go back, and you're wasting that kind of money, just enslaving yourself more. The money you spend yourself, you know, stuff you're spending your money on is just enslaving yourself more. Do something that's going to create a legacy for you. Put yourself around winners. You got to be around winners. So just do it. I'm talking to you to winners. The other guys that deciding to be losers, you go go lose. Continue to do what you want to do. All right. So there. And it's father. You're on a roll. Oh, um, yes, yeah. it is Father's Day. Um, again, just encourage you guys take a look at your your family. Um, you're, you're blessed um, to have a, a wife and a family. Um, so spend some time really thinking about what your legacy, what you want your legacy to be for your family. Right, just because you had sex with a woman and had a child doesn't make you a father, <laughs> man. 
you know, that is so, you know, just because you like watching your kid go out there and play ball doesn't make you a father. And, what makes uh, you a father? Makes you a father standing up like a man and taking care of your family, doing what it takes to create the security for your family, all right? To create the life for your family, to provide the opportunity for your family. And there's no excuse, certainly here in the U.S., okay, or in the U.S., you know, there, no one's dying to go to, and people are dying to come to the U.S. So my U.S. brothers, you have no freaking excuse. I don't care what color you are, where you come from, but there's no, there's no better time in the U.S. To certainly to succeed. It's just you've, choose, you've chosen to be a loser, all right? So for my other, my brothers, you know, my Aussie brothers, New Zealand brothers, Canadian, U.K., South African. You had a Norway person. Norway, day, right. Yeah. You know, I, you got a little, you know, I, I get it, you know. Um, the U.S. is, you know, U.S. is unique. We're the only, we're the only people, and by, by the way, we're people who come from all over, from your countries, all right? But we're the only people that decided we were a free people, and we did something about it. We decided to be free, all right? That's what the U.S.A. is all about. And so this is what standing up for yourself is all about. That's what I want for you guys, free. That's, you want to be free, not a slave. Not a slave to the system, not a slave to some government, not a slave to some belief system, not a slave to, well, I can't because I, my daddy was, uh, that's a bunch of bull crap, okay? I'm this color, a uh, man's against me, uh, that's a bunch of bull crap, all right? I didn't go to college, uh, that's a bunch of bull crap. It's never been easier in the plumbing industry. It's great, all right? So get it done. You got anything to add to that? Ooh, I can't wait to see what kind of day we're today. I am pumped, and I want <laughs> I want it for you guys. <coughs> I can't even breathe. <laughs> so worked up, and it's so simple. It's so simple. Team you up know? with your wife. Team up with your wife. You got married for a reason, right? Because you cared about each other. You liked being right. being around each other. You probably had dreams when you got married. Find right. those dreams again. Find there them. we go. Team up with your wife. Get it done. That's how, that's how God created it. Yes, God created the earth. God created the universe. You didn't crawl out of come, some kind of slime, all right? You were purposefully created, all right? And I'm talking to my brothers here. You know, guys, you were created to be the leader, the king, to do it all, but it wasn't quite perfect, so God gave us woman. And oh my, has that ever been good, right? It is good, all right? It's a good thing. Thank you. But it also makes us stronger, all right? So team up with your wife and, and get it done. Well, my wife doesn't do that bull, bull crap, okay? All right? Team up together. Lead your wife into it. Show your wife. Stop sitting back, sitting back in the chair, getting fatter, all right? Stop stuffing your pie hole full of more food, more food. I'm not telling you never go out and eat and have a beer. Man, I love going out and having to eat and having a beer, all right? I'll drink most of you guys under the table, okay? <laughs> but I'm, you just don't, yeah, man. You just don't do it every day, all right? Okay, work on work on that naughty body, all right? Nothing's more fun having a naughty body, if you know what I'm talking about, okay? All right, but it also keeps you alive, all right? Be the king, be the king. So do it, get it done. Decide to do your own thing. Free yourselves, free yourself. Stop working, you know, Stop working for whatever just because you were told that's that's what you had to do. So I guess that's what I. So what you had to say today? Hey man, it's I, good. I, You're I, pumped. I, I am pumped. I went up and wait this morning. All right. You know. Good for all right, you, baby. Man, Way to go. You know, all right. This is, I got. I'm a lean, mean fighting <laughs> machine. I'm gonna show you later what else I am, baby. All right. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. All right, guys. Hey. Again, for you guys who want to be a winner, I didn't, I didn't, uh, didn't want to plan on doing that. But hey, come part, be part of my inner circle, all right? Come join the winning team. Be part of, be part of winners, all right? The Million Dollar Plumber. dot com forward slash go dash pro, all right, all right. Don't, don't bring your pansy hood with you, okay? Don't bring pansiness with you. Don't be whining, bitching, and moaner, moaning, and all that. Hey, I see a couple. I got a couple of Aussie friends on here. Don't be a bunch of wankers. <laughs> all right okay bring it all right wankers is not well, good i'm assuming i'm not i'm assuming it's not good you know i think one of my my aussie haters called me a wanker or something like that i don't think well, it's we had to ask i think it was glenn or joe is wanker I can't go, yeah, is wanker at, good or bad no it's, i don't think it's good <laughs> so whatever it is whatever that is don't bring that little boy pansy stuff okay talking about winning all right 
we're, we're talking about defeating the enemy, mm -hmm. the enemy of complacency, complacency, the enemy of wimpiness, the the enemy of um, enslavement. All right, coming talking about being free men. All right, we're free men at the uh, GoPro Inner Circle. All right, it's free men, and more specifically, 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 sp specifically, specifically, we are free plumbing professionals. Mm -hmm. Professionals. Hey, you guys that just wanna, you know, you wanna just share a bunch of, you know, nudie pics and throw out f bombs and talk dirty and all that. Hey, that that's fine. You know, it's Frenchy. You got that? You guys stay over there, okay? But professional plumbers. This is where the professional plumbers are. Where we're creating legacies, legacies, kingdoms for our families, all right? Not being little slave boys for everybody else. So there you have it. Is that it? That is it on this Saturday morning. So all think right. about it. What are you doing, okay? All right, we're man. We're gonna crush it today, it sounds like. We're gonna crush it, man. We, we got some stuff to get done we here. Do. Yep, a lot of stuff. We're building our kingdom even larger. Mm -hmm. You know, the million dollar plumber kingdom mm -hmm. is growing and it's a beautiful <laughs> life. All right. So there we have it. Okay. All right. You go get yours or, or not. Go be somebody's boy. Hey, we'll talk to you later. Happy Saturday, everybody.